Good morning. I thought I would vlog today. Um, I have a morning with Rue and then he's got half day at nursery. It's a school day. Um, but yeah, just thought I would try and get back into it. <laughs> Testing the school run. Rue is watching a little cartoon just while I get some Instagram copy what done. What is it called? Your cartoon, uh, something about lava, I think. I hate this cartoon. I'm doing a bit of Instagram copy for a Sky job that is being sent over for approval today. I should have done it at the weekend, but the weekend is always quite hectic. It was Mother's Day yesterday in England. So <coughs> happy Mother's Day. <coughs> I know lots of you watching a mum, sorry about him. I need to start training him not to do that, it's so annoying. I'm also going to do my morning journal, five minute journal. I think I've talked about this on Instagram already, but I absolutely love it. Since I've got it, I've done it every single day. It's so manageable and it's just a really nice way to kind of actually kind of reflect on your day and what you want from your day and then what you've kind of appreciated from your day what you want to carry forward um for the next one um and just you kind of start to see a pattern with the things that are important to you and the things that you value and um just moments that you kind of realize are the important ones um and i feel like i've got to a point where there's a bit in the bottom that says how could i have made today even better and even on the days where the kids have been stressful or something's gone wrong or whatever, quite often in the evening I'll get to that point of that of that point of the diary and be like, I don't know how I could have made this better because we had some really nice moments, even if we also had stressful times or things went wrong, the good moments kind of outweigh the bad. And quite often, unless you sit down and actually think about that, it can feel like you've had a hard day or that it's been a bad day um so yeah i'm gonna do that now so we've so got one, two makes four. you're right we've got four plants that need repotting this guy is too big for this one i grew him from um a cutting i propagated him from another one which i accidentally killed but he's alive this person i never actually potted properly i just stuck him in there this one, I don't know what happened, but it needs some more soil. And then this guy is not loving his life, so I'm going to move him from that little pot into this big pot, and hopefully that'll keep him alive for a bit longer. Thank you, Rue. Please. And then hopefully, I'm not very good at this. Please don't die. Hopefully, if I give it a gentle pull. Oh, there we go, I've got it. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> oh! We'll put it in here like this. Oh. That's better, isn't it? But it's it still bit. dying. I think he'll be okay when he's got a new home. I'll do it with this little spoon. Don't need too much. Just pop it in there. That's it. And another bit. Pop, 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 pop. Nice. Da, 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 da. A bit more. Okay. Da, 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 da. Oh, he's got some new plants. Too. He does. He's got a new leaf. That's cool, isn't it? Why can't we pick these plants? Well, we don't eat those ones. They're just for decoration. Da -da. <gasps> Here he comes. Poor little guy. <laughs> Surviving on that much soil. You ready? Will we fit? That's good. Do you want to do the top soil? Oh. Like that? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, there's so much there. Yeah, you're going to do the rest? Mm. 
just come to the park to bring the doggies out for their walk. Rue's having a little ride along Scoot. You can't do the monkey bars, but what can you do? Uh, uh, climb on the thing that has spots on it. <gasps> no way! Yeah. You're such a big boy! A little bit of real life here for you. <laughs> yeah, I feel like you guys only ever see like this bit of my kitchen um, on Instagram when it's clean. But yeah, this is what it really looks like most of the time. More power. Nice. <coughs> Can you do it? Uh huh. There's only two of us, is it? Okay, Rufus has gone to nursery, and I have two hours before I have to pick up Ruth, um, Grayson from school. So I am going to do 20 minutes of yoga and then I am going to watch the rest of my, I have a um, anatomy lecture that I'm doing as part of my online yoga teacher training. So I'm doing the 200 hour course finally. I'll probably try and talk a little bit more about it later on, but I've only got two hours now. So I'm kind of trying to like um, use it wisely because it's not that long before the kids get home and I, I feel like I want to accomplish getting a little bit more of my course done because I'm really excited about the anatomy part being over I'm not gonna lie I do find it quite um, dull and there's bits that I want to do that are later on in the course that you can't unlock until you've completed the anatomy so I'm gonna go and do that now thought I would um, watch my online lecture in a daytime bath because I never get to do a daytime bath and if I've got to watch an iPad I might as well be in the bath multitasking. <laughs> Just picked up Grayson from school. <laughs> he doesn't want to be on camera. Um, we are going to get some staples from the shops like um, milk and bread and uh, dinner and then I want to get some nail varnish too because my nails are disgusting and naked and I can't handle it. All done! I got ribs! He's a little bit cross with me because I bought him popcorn instead of marshmallows. <laughs> Home to unpack the shopping, finish the dishwasher, get the next load of washing on, cook the dinner. <sighs> it's exhausting! just brought the boys up to their favourite tree to climb for a few minutes after dinner instead of watching TV because uh, they just got a lot of energy to burn so I'm going to make sure they're good and tired for bedtime tonight and also it's just really nice outside at this time of the evening it's only about half five but the light's nice and the birds are singing and it's just really chill out here so they can go climbing in their tree and I can just chill <laughs> And you. <laughs> Good girl. Boys are in bed. They're not asleep yet. Um, Steph's turn to sit with Rufus tonight. We started sitting with him again um, just because he's been hair pulling quite a lot. So um, we just want to keep an eye on it. And yeah, it just seems to be like whenever he's alone, that's when he'll do it. So Steph's turn tonight. I did last night. So I've lit the fire. I'm gonna do probably like a 30 minutes of yoga and then watch some of my um, yoga teacher training lecture slides, make some notes. Then I'm gonna paint my nails and watch a bit of crap on TV uh, to wind down. Might read a little bit of a book as well. But um, So I'm watching on Netflix at the moment, Ginny and Georgia, or Georgia and Ginny, I don't know which way around it is. Um, but yeah, it's, if you can get past like the first half of the first episode, it's like a good one to have on in the background when you're doing boring stuff like laundry and like, yeah, vacuuming and things like that. Um, so yeah, I might watch a little bit of that. 
um but yeah i think i'm probably gonna end this vlog here just because i'm quite tired now and i don't feel like i've got anything to offer in terms of like chat just telling you what I'm doing. Um, not that I normally do anyway. Uh, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed this vlog and I will see you in my next one. Bye.